Yes, uh, absolutely. Absolute good afternoon. Um, as soon as I heard the family were on the way to tomorrow, this is this is definitely very serious because when I worked for the royal family, I mean, the family don't make these kind of journeys for no reason. So I'm, I like everyone else, I'm, I'm quite concerned about this news. Remains comfortable and at Balmoral. Um, what can you tell us about Balmoral? Um, what does uh, Balmoral mean to her? Why, why has she spent so much time there and why does she favour it? But the model castle is, is obviously one of her private homes. She has two pr homes that are privately belong to, to her, which is Sandra the model. The model is somewhere that she always felt safe. It's a, it's a family home. It's somewhere that she had many, many half years with her late husband, Prince Philip. It's, it's, a, it's, it's a safety net. It's somewhere she feels secure and safe. And I, I can understand why. I mean, I used to go up with the family and I know how much they love it. So I can see why she wants to be up there. Um, obviously, she's always up there at this time of year, regardless. But it was said recently that she may extend her stay. And uh, Grant, let's just uh, reflect uh, that we uh, understand she was at one of the lodges, I think, rather than at the main castle when she arrived there uh, uh, in July. And we were told at that time that uh, I think a, a stair um, lift had been in, installed and that she had a sort of golf buggy that she was using to get round. And as we've heard from previous royal commentators, she obviously wouldn't have wanted to be seen to having to be used these devices, that, you know, um, being seen to be in control is very important for her. She wears all these outfits that can be seen um, very colourful. That's a very important aspect of her job. It, it, it is, uh, absolutely. I mean, she's somebody that, she's very proud of her mobility. She's fat that, you know, the fact that she up until recently didn't use a, a walking stick. She's obviously of, of um, a certain age now where a lot of people by that age are using walking sticks or in wheelchairs. She's a very proud lady. She, she didn't want to, she didn't want to do that. She didn't want to be seen uh, in a wheelchair or, or, you know, using a walking stick. I think that's quite a big thing for her to let people see her do that. Remember her mother, uh, was seen obviously using sticks and, and things, but obviously a few years older. Where I think, I think the Queen just, to be honest, I don't think she wanted to get old. You know, she's mm. not in her heart. She's a very young person. That's what I remember about her. Even when I knew her, when she was in her eighties, she was still very young.